Basket YouTube! It's your boys, Rufa Gorgeous. And I'm back with another fucking banging show ever. So, what we're we gonna do here? This is episode one of many. You know what I'm saying? Can you feel the energy? Hey, yo, man, give me a shot, man. Give me a shot. You know, don't, don't tell me to breathe. Give me a shot. Give me my shot, bro. <laughs> give me my shot, bro. Ah, yeah. oh, my background crew is always, you know, is always on point and always ready to work. So what we're we gonna do, guys? This is gonna be a new show called the Black Door. That's what I'm gonna call it. So what's gonna basically happen here? We're gonna have one of your favorite celebs, YouTuber, musician, um, porn star, whatever it is, man. We're gonna have them here sitting next to me, and I'm gonna be questioning them. The first. There's two parts to this show. So what's gonna happen? I'm gonna ask them. Ten things they can't live about. <laughs> Ten things they can't live without. Excuse me. English is not my mother tongue. That's why it's really gorgeous. <laughs> so yeah, forgive me for that. Ten things they can't live without. And then we're gonna get into their personal life and ask them, you know, where they see themselves in the future. You know, we're just gonna ask them like all that goody shiri, you know, ask them, even if they say they're trending during the time about something, when I ask them, like, we're going to make sure the topic relates to that. We, you're just going to keep you guys updated. It's like a, a new podcast show, but better and new and hosted by me, your one and only, Zulu very gorgeous. I know I've been gone for a while, but I'm back, baby. I'm back. You know what I'm saying? I am back. Subscribe, share, comment. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> What's good guys, so girl Chantal Mguni aka Cherry Gababako and welcome to Zulu Boy Gorgeous YouTube channel. As you can see, guys, we're doing things a little bit more differently today. I'm going to be interviewing your favorite influencer and have him tell me more about his life, apart from what you guys see on the social media life. You understand? You know how they love living with fake jewelries and all that fake life. So without wasting any time, let me get so, into it. Zulu Boy, yeah. tell us, who are you? So, what's good, YouTube? It's your boys, we were gorgeous, and I'm here with my co-host, Chantel Mguni, a.k.a. Cherry Babako on Instagram. So, she just asked me who I am, and I'm about to tell you who Zulu Gorgeous is. So, my name is Tandului Shange, which means love, and I don't know how to deal with that feeling or emotion. So, let's move on from that. So, what do you have for me? So, guys, today we have two stages of the show. The first stage, I'll ask Zulu Boy about the 10 things he cannot live without. And on the second stage, I'll dive in deeper into discussions and have him tell me more about himself. You understand? So, Zulu Boy, what are 10 things you cannot live without? <laughs> One, woman. <laughs> supposed to not live without is your mom bruh i said i said woman oh i'm supposed to say a woman oh uh, why is it because of i don't know the forbidden kingdom what maybe but like listen man if adam was able to eat the apple why can't i <laughs> power. the second thing you cannot live without money money i, I get it why push and pee what does that mean? What's push and pee? Am I the only one who doesn't know? You push and pee, 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 pee. You feel me? You get it? Okay. If you don't get it, forget about what? it. Push and pee means get on oh, paper. Oh, push pee. Oh, no, 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 no. Push yeah. and pee. Yeah. <laughs> that means okay. Like get on paper. Like, money is, like, important to me. Like, I saw as a gent, mm -hmm. I feel like without money, you kind of, yeah. you kind of, you know, 
ain't if you ain't got money brah like i don't know what to say you understand as for you know life is easier for girls when they do not have money you're probably going to marry into a rich family or a rich man you understand what bro what are you talking about man but when you're a gen, bruh, uh, you fuck for life. Exactly. So moving on to that it's question. About tri- it's about, it's tricky. Yeah, you understand? It's, yeah. Hmm. That thing I can't live without. You can't live without money. Do you have money though? I took out a PP loan for this shit. Of course I have money, baby. Go. They haven't called me Big Zulu for nothing, you know what I'm saying? Paper all the way. <laughs> 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 Final question now. <laughs> 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 Not yet. Okay. Not yet. I don't have money yet. I don't I don't know what to call it. It's changed what I have. Oh, right it's yo, you have money, but then it's still waiting for you somewhere. Yeah. It's still, yeah, it's still gonna come, guys. It's money it's not in my hands, but it's still. Yeah. So yeah, that was the th- that was the second thing. No, that is the second thing, yeah. The so third the third thing, thing I love Cars. I feel like I love cars. Cars, really? Yeah. What's your favorite car? Lambo. Lamborghini. Lamb talk. Uh. Yeah, lamb talk, lambo. Skirt. Lamb talk, lambo. When it lambo. comes to when it comes to supercars, you know what I'm saying? Mm, Exotic cars. When you planning on getting that lambo? Two years time. Come pick me up. <laughs> Are you hitting on me? <laughs> no, <laughs> she's no, hitting on me. <laughs> okay, so yeah, so uh, cars. You know what I'm so saying? Swine. Fourth Moving thing. Moving on, the fourth thing you cannot live without. Um, trip clothes. Drip clothes. Why? I feel like I'm just like you have to look good if you're a nigga. Yeah, hey guys, my coat looks swanky. Guys, I'm swanky. Oh, yeah. Imagine my coat looks swanky. Guys, cotton. You know, we must eat the cotton. See the cotton, my friends. So, moving on, fifth thing you cannot live without. Pipe. Weed, you know, Uguti, you understand you're getting high. What about pipe? What are you guys feeling there? I wouldn't know. I don't smoke weed. But pipe, pipe, like, it gives you, like, you know, you know, if you die doing something you love, it's fine. Heaven. Pipe, like, yeah. Pipe. Heaven. I'm a bad bitch. <laughs> I'm a bad bitch. That's all I'm going to say. I'm, I drink champagne. I smoke pipe. I'm a bad bitch. Bad bitch. Sit together, girl, guys. Cut the B. Oh, my God. What is that? So, moving on, moving on. City one. girls worldwide. What's the fifth thing you cannot live without? Alcohol. Okay. It's nothing personal. We work, we rock. Today we're rocking. <laughs> December time, summer time. <laughs> it's not personal. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, cheers to that. <laughs> nah. Oh, we're cheers. Oh, cheers. <laughs> Yo, I've been drinking alcohol for the longest of time, you know. When, when shit is rough, when things are tough. There are two things in life I regret today. Number one is taking that first ever beer. And number two is not taking that beer earlier in my life. Because as I'm sitting here today, I am indeed a few years behind. So let's move, guys. Um, what is the seventh thing you cannot live without? God. Oh my God. <laughs> this guy. God should have been the negative first, the negative one person he cannot live without. You understand? Why does God have to be the seventh thing you cannot live without? Yeah, I just can't live without God because you know. With everything I do in my life, I pray to God first and I ask Him to bless You pray to God God what? First? First. Why wasn't He the first thing? To mention. Why? Because I've been lying. (laughs) Don't get me wrong. Don't get me wrong. I love God. Don't get me wrong. I love God. God comes first, bro. If I said God first, I'd be lying. Guys, if the gem doesn't love God, he will never love you. Before I pray, I drink. Just move. Before you pray, you drink. Yeah, if I... You drink before you pray. You do not pray before you drink. No. So, what is the eighth thing you cannot live without? Mmm... Probably my phone. Yeah, ne? Yeah. That's smart. Because that's that's your life. That's your life. 
as an influencer, that's your life. If my photos off, I feel like I'm going crazy. Hey, that's what you show, like guys. Like, literally, it's like, it's like drugs. I'm so addicted to my phone, guys. If my phone is off, I feel like crazy for circles. Like, I must, my phone must be on. Because everything I do is on my phone. From making money, to promoting, to my lifestyle. Like, I always I'm not into it. Like, everything is just it's happening it's on my phone. So, like, yeah. Yes, trendy. Hey, Jiggy G. And then moving on, what is the ninth thing you cannot live without? Social uh, media. Anything that keeps me busy when I'm bored. I'm hey, busy. yo, at least, what is the tenth thing you cannot live without? Think again. Well, I don't this is an exam, like, you have to write. No, I just feel get like I know People what I can do. Know. Like, I'm a person of, you know, like, I, I love to love. I can't live without love. Oh shame. I believe in love. I will not let this generation take the road. <laughs> they already hate me, but I love them. I but then like true facts guys guys, you see, in a relationship a guy has to love more in order for the relationship to last. If he doesn't, the relationship won't last. You understand? You get what I'm saying. But then that's it guys, those are the ten things he cannot live without. So as I see there are two stages on this show. The second stage is where he digs deeper about his life. We want to know the Zulu boy. We want to know the Zulu boy before. Yeah, then we want to know Tando. You, there is no Zulu boy. We want to know Tando. You understand? We want to know Tando fame pop. We want to know Tando Mpunga days. We want to know Tando broke days. We want to know Tando family. We want to know Tando. You understand? We want some intel. I don't want him to tell us about what we already know. I'm Zulu boy. Instagram live. You understand those kind of things. We want to know who he really is. Like the real time you understand like the real thing yeah, really. i hope you get guys this has been nice like i really enjoyed this i enjoyed it too really yes i want to be here next time definitely on whichever video you're dropping this time yes mm. you're my co-host mm, thank you it's been nice guys i really enjoyed don't forget i'm cherry back on ig and his Zulu boy god so guys one thing i've realized about Zulu boy he's a Zulu man with some power you understand he, he gets things done and i trust that he'll achieve each and everything that his heart desires you understand the fancy car the beautiful wife the family and everything he wants understand you should get that bag don't forget to follow him and subscribe on his youtube channel so that you guys make his dreams come true but then you guys have been so nice it's been a very beautiful time i've had a bit i've had a bit of i've had yes i've had a very beautiful time with you guys and it's been a very good moment mm. good night yeah